Okay, what are we looking at? Here are the circuit boards, Ethernet and power, the piano action, Audacity stream, data from my Teensy and Octave software, packet status. Let's do that again. Now to get eight keys working. Drilling the hammer position sensor mounts, soldering two more boards. That gives me three boards, now five boards. The 0.2 revision boards are slightly longer to get better alignment over the hammers. I originally selected R1 equals 180 ohms, but 150 gives a little better dynamic range. Drilling to mount all eight hammer position sensor boards. It's really difficult to get perfect alignment drilling one at a time like this, but I designed it to be adjustable. I had to rebuild the hammer stop and electronics frame that I had shown in a previous video because for some reason it decided to warp. I spent quite a bit of time getting every hammer stop to the exact string height. Let's test it. So far I don't see any major problems. My auto calibration algorithm automatically adjusts for all of the board and sensor height variations, which is really convenient to get a consistent volume. 